Got it. Okay, now finally, it is International Women's Day today, Adam. Rugby League, known for its Man of Steel award, but it's a big sport among women too. Indeed it is. In fact, Rugby League uh, as a sport has one of the highest proportions of female followers with 50% uh, of supporters women. Danielle Titterington's uh, one of the England team and she told us why she thinks it's so popular. It's really at the peak of its development at the moment. It's a really good time for any of the girls to get involved. Um, it's come on load since I started playing a long, long time ago. Um, yeah, it's just a great opportunity. I'd suggest it to anybody. Give it a try. What's the appeal? Um, you know, just the nature of the game, it's, it's, it's not just great for the social side of it, but the fitness side of it as well. You know, it gets people involved in the community and all sorts as well. And just looking at the, the number of girls that there are playing here, clearly it's, it's, it's on the growth. And um, I mean, that reflects pretty healthily on rugby league itself, doesn't it? Yeah, it certainly does. It certainly does. Um, as I said before, you know, the development of it is really coming on. And there's some great teams out there. Yeah. Okay, so why do you think then that rugby league is so popular? among female fans? I think it's the, the fact that um, a lot of women are supposed to be so petite and yet there are times when they want to get rid of the you know, the frustrations and adrenaline and uh, rugby league gives them that opportunity. I remember many, many years ago when uh, I played in the charity game against a woman's side and uh, I feared for my life. I mean, they were rough and they were tough. They, they really gave it to me. And it's, uh, there's nothing wrong with that, you know, because there's a physical side to, to all human beings and uh, you can get rid of the frustration. And that's the one good thing about our sport. You know, and that's why so many youngsters go into it because in, instead of going wayward and going down the wrong path of society, sport can help you with that. And I think the aggression that you can take out of it, women need to be able to, you know, impose themselves and say, well, I want to get rid of this in aggression. But I also feel that the reason why they, they love it is that you can go and watch our game. It, it is a family sport. It's very rare that you find that we have problems on the terraces. So you can take your family and, of course, you can take your children, but you can also take your girlfriend, you can take your wife. And the reason why I think it is so popular is the thighs, the men's thighs. I ask a lot of the women, I say, you know, but why? You know, say, oh, to see those guys. And let's face it, to see those wonderful athletes going down the field and the, the rippling thighs going, and you think, hmm, they've got a point. I would agree. That's the main reason. Uh, well, it's not the main <laughs> reason, but it, it's certainly one of them. And, uh, a little I, I, highlight for look, us. Look, I'm glad that they embrace it because they know how good a sport it is. And I'm so pleased that, uh, that, that yeah. women play the game. And why not? It's all about multitasking, that's why. That's how we feel good at it. Mm. Oh, go. happy International Women's Day. Thank you very much, Steve. Thank you.